Hello, in this video I will show you how to clone a larger HDD to a smaller SSD for free with Disk Genius Tool. Before we start, to stay up to date with my latest videos, please make sure to subscribe to my channel by clicking the button above this video, and please stay tuned until the end of this video so you don't miss any steps. For this video, I will use Windows 10 and Disk Genius Tool and a SATA USB adapter to connect the new SSD disk. So, let's start by downloading and installing Disk Genius. Go to DiskGenius.com website. Let's talk a little about Disk Genius. It's an all-in-one tool for managing partitions along with data recovery and backup, restore functions, check and repair disk. Disk Genius provides a clone partition to copy all data from one disk or partition to another without interrupting any running programs. It assures you a copy 100% identical to the original drive with full protection of your data against any potential risks. Click on Free Download, then click the executable file to launch the install. Now please focus, on these steps it's very very important because you can easily make a mistake to choose the source disk and the target disk, especially when the two disks are of the same brand and the same size. In my case, I have the HDD disk larger than the SSD disk. But for you, you should have the total size of data you want to clone from the HDD disk not bigger than the total size on the SSD disk. For example, you can't make this clone with Clonezilla it has limitations like the destination partition must be equal or larger than the source one. This is the most interesting thing about DiskGenius tool. Let's go to cloning then. For that, you must have an adapter SATA USB like in the video to connect the SSD disk. Or if you have a NVMe disk you can find an adapter for NVMe. You can find it on Amazon, if you don't have it, I will let you an Amazon link if you want to purchase it. Put the disk and the adapter together and connect both. You can now see it on Disk Genius Tools. Go to Tools then Clone Disk. Select the source disk. When the message, do you want migrate system right now does appear, click on no. If you click yes, you will just migrate the system partition. Now select the target disk. You can now see that all partitions do appear on the SSD disk but don't have the same size. Make sure the boot partition has the same size, for that right click and click keep size, Otherwise you can resize all other partitions with the size you like. If you are sure click OK. Now if you want to make a hot migration you can click on hot migration, else you can click reboot to DOS for more security and fully protect your data against any potential risks.
The cloning will start as we speak. Once cloning is complete, you should shut down the PC and disconnect the SSD disk. Now, I will remove the HDD disk and put the SSD disk. That's all, it's easy. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think of this video in the comment. Make sure to subscribe, so you don't miss out on my future videos.